Hello there ladies and gentlemen and welcome to this little bit of a video log and update uh, with me trying us. Uh, yesterday I put up a very small notice that I wouldn't be doing any videos this week because I've got this silly cold. You can probably hear it in my throat. Yesterday I could barely talk without coughing every other word uh, which was horrible. Uh, a bit of a headache, runny nose, you know, man flu, stupid thing, you know what it's like. Uh, uh, but yeah, uh, there's also something else that's maybe happening next week. As some of you, but probably not many know, uh, I'm going to be moving house soon. And it could be next week that I'm doing it, which is kind of put everything boom especially with my cold and everything like that uh we were we're expecting we were expecting it to be done this month but we were expecting another two maybe three weeks but it may end up being next week uh so that means i'm not gonna have any sort of internet access uh from sunday maybe even sooner i don't know as yet and i don't know when i will actually get it back uh, so I kind of wanted to let you know about that. Uh, however, uh, there's something, some good news. Once I do get back up and running and everything settled, again, I don't know how long that will be, I'll be starting in a new world, which you guys helped me decide. Thank you for all those people that voted. Ten votes, which was absolutely fantastic in total. Uh, but the majority of them were for me to do a new series using uh, the, all the mods which is now a 1.10 pack which is what this actually world is that I'm in now because I was doing a little bit of pre-survival work here uh, got my little bit of a tree farm there got a house behind me got a tinker smell tree and a small farm there a lot of the stuff I did is because you guys have already seen it before uh, but I'm going to now have to restart all this lot uh, because, uh, which it's a bad thing and a good thing because a bad thing because I need to restart. But a good thing is because of why I need to restart because one of the mods that they've added into this now is mechanism. I actually got mechanism. Uh, so I need to restart because obviously mechanism has the ore of osmium in the world so uh, like I say there won't actually be any generated here and unless I go and find some new chunks it's a little bit annoying so I can restart uh, but I did like I said I did quite a bit of work already on here and I thought I'd show you a little bit around I mean this is the area that I chose which I thought was kind of cool in between a savanna biome and a desert biome which is nice lush green area uh, or plains right next to the sea uh, and uh, like I say I've made myself a smell tree a endofluid tank uh, which is obviously holding lava, lava which is inputting directly into this I have a redstone clock so I can automatically make walls and stuff and I chose this area because obviously it had this in here as well, the lava right next door, which is really nice. Uh, obviously, I built myself this little house uh, with a little bit of chisel and whatnot work into it, as you can see. I've uh, got a farm here, some potatoes, carrots, this canola from actually additions, which I want to get into, uh, flex and seeds now the flax gives you string which is absolutely awesome uh, the canola gives you uh, seeds and this canola plant which is actually used as some sort of fuel but I won't go into that now it's still something I'm learning so uh, hopefully we can learn that together uh, a couple of ender lily seeds which you can actually get now at a 0.00% chance, I think it's 0 0.01, but it says 0, 0.00 in the thing, by just punching grass, uh, which is kind of cool. It's unlikely I'll be able to get any here and now, but if you just punch the grass, uh, you get different things, roots and seeds, obviously, but 
Uh, like it, it's so slim, it's not going to show on camera. Very rare that it's going to show on camera, but that's how you can get a few end of lily seeds, which is really cool. I like that. I don't know which mod actually does that. I know the end of lily seeds are from extra utilities, but I don't know if that does the grass as well. Uh, inside, uh, some Tinker Tool Stations, including the uh, Tool Forge, which is the next stage. I found some bee stuff for forestry, a mod I haven't done in a long time. Uh, let me just get rid of that. <coughs> uh, obviously, food. I did get the actually edition manual, just to start learning stuff. Uh, a load of resources, a couple of diamonds and whatnot, not much, but as you can see, I was doing a lot, a lot of prep work for this. Uh, wood, furnaces, some basic storage drawers, uh, which I never particularly liked, but I need it for the cobble. Uh, then we can get on to what was currently the roof, what's going to be the second floor, but never mind. And then the mines going down there. And they've altered how quickly you actually go down them. Look how fast that is now. <laughs> I won't go all the way down there. It's just a normal strip mine. Uh, but yeah, there, were, there is something that I'm curious of. Uh, and I thought I was going to do it on camera. Anyway. Uh, but uh, just over here. So I was going to try and save some of the like adventure and things to do on camera. Oh yes, there's this nice big ravine as well. Which... I wanted to break into at some point, but maybe even do a few building projects in and around that thing. But you can see this is a normal desert temple, probably nothing much in it, but it's something I wanted to do on camera for the very first episode. Uh, obviously, this is it the first episode. Uh, this was just to let you know that you know I'm not may not be around for the next a bit longer than I originally expected because I just thought that well I'll just have a week off because I'm not feeling well and so on and so forth and I can't particularly talk right uh, but uh, and then we'll come in here I'll show you what I do come in here and then the entire world decides to gang up on me again so <laughs> uh, so yeah we'll just see what's down here if anything and then we'll have, I'll have to do a restart as and when I can. A uh, bit of a quick question though. Do you want to join me right from the beginning or do you want me to do what I've already done? Always a bit of a if and but situation. Uh, so let me know in the comment section below if you want to start right from the beginning or whatever. So, you know, do let me know. I keep forgetting about this hand. Get, get, we've got a left hand now <laughs> in modded Minecraft. Anyway, let's see what we've got in here. Uh, let me just dump this slot in. Uh, note back enchantment, a map. I don't know what the map's about, we'll have a look. A capacitor of the southern winds, an attached note describes this as a nice smelting enhanced capacitor. Oh, so that's a enchanted capacitor. Wow, okay. Right, okay, that's interesting. Um, but nothing too major in that one. Let's have a look at that. Uh, mystery of fowl wrapped in this fire premium planting wonder capacitor can be upgraded free of charge to capacitor one. Press OK to abort or do so. What? Uh, a desert sapling. I don't know why I'm really taking this stuff, but a staff of traveling. That's nice. Uh, what we got in this one? An ender sword, a foul capacity. If you had described this nice, hungry, simple, indestable capacitor, dud would be a good name. So that's a dud capacitor. A building wand, which would have been nice. A steadfast drone and some other stuff. Okay, and lastly, a uh, magic capacitor. This good, big, simple, hot, simple, planting, simple, indescribable capacitor dud. It's a property of Randolph the ex tinkerer. Unauthorized removal is welcome. <laughs> oh dear. The people at Ender.io had some fun. Another building's one. Uh, 
biome crystal overgrown cliffs from random things that's a new one on me as well and a golden apple why not uh so yeah actually some decent stuff in here with this uh uh items uh, i don't know what these capacitors are actually all about nor do i know what this thing is but yeah pretty cool actually uh, and obviously some of the other resources may have come in handy uh, this early but yeah let's eat the golden apple might as well there we go uh, so yeah like I say I'm going to be restarting this world uh, I don't know when as yet probably as soon as possible really uh, but do let me know in the comment section what uh, you want to see whether or not it's a uh, a full restart from me punching wood or would you prefer a God, I'm, really lost. I'm busy talking uh, from punching wood or do you want me to do what I've already done and that's basically just get some of the basics set up because uh, I dare say a few people know about Ender IO and what not uh, Tinker's Construct hello Mr. Creeper uh, looks like we've got a few extra mob mobs in here and now as well because I don't remember seeing them before. Let me just quickly run home. Not that it matters now, but you know, because uh, it does look like we've got Ender IO mobs in here as well. So I think that's been added. I don't remember seeing any of them before. Uh, but yeah, anyway. Um, I'm going to end this here. Do let me know what you want to see in this mod, uh, whether a full restart or doing this. Uh, but please do bear with me. I will maybe gone for quite some time. We'll see how things happen. Hopefully not too long, but uh, yeah, uh, do bear with me. And uh, thank you very much for voting. Thank you very much for those that commented on my last SIG video. Uh, and I hope to be back up and running and at full strength as soon as possible. <laughs> so thank you very much for joining me. And I'll see you as quickly as possible. Thank you. Bye.